Indonesia has no ill intent in naming its new Navy frigate the KRI Usman Tharun, Foreign Minister Martin Art Halagawa said on Tuesday, in an attempt to repair a bilateral row with Singapore that has dominated headlines over the past week. No ill intent, no ill will, and no malice is intended, Dr. Marty said in an interview with The Straits Times, adding that Jakarta took the recent turn of events seriously. We are keen to ensure there is a sense of mutual respect if where the other is coming from and we can both move forward. Speaking in Jakarta today, Dr. Marty said that Indonesia is drawing appropriate lessons from the incident. The most important uh, message that must be underscored and must be understood is that no ill intent uh, is meant behind uh, the naming of these uh, naval vessels. Uh, the reality is uh, Indonesia and Singapore enjoys extremely close relations uh, that's you know really mutually beneficial marked by complementarity uh, of interests and uh, recent the episode of the past one week i think uh, uh, reminds us that while relations are very strong and very very close uh, we need to constantly nurture uh, this relationship and ensure that there is no unintended complications arises from uh, decisions uh, made uh, from whichever side. Uh, you know, the fact that this decision was made, uh, perhaps uh, of the naming of the vessels, was, I guess, made under the assumption as if this, was a, this has been a closed chapter, right, in 1973, and therefore those who had made the decision must have felt that this should not cause any more furore because it's already so closed. And, and obviously it hasn't. It, it is creating some new dynamics. Uh, so we, have, uh, we are drawing uh, the appropriate uh, lessons learned from it in terms of both of us, Indonesia and Singapore, I'm sure. And uh, we will move forward. Singapore Foreign Minister Kei Shan Mogam had called Dr. Marty last Wednesday to raise concerns about the Indonesian Navy's decision to name the vessel after Osman Mohamed Ali and Harun Saeed, two Marines who bombed McDonald House in Orchard Road in 1965 that left three dead and 33 hurt.